Spurs fans, it looks like our team is going downtown. Go Spurs, go, cause the Giants stay. What is up, San Antonio Spurs fans? Welcome to TSR Sports. I came across this article from the San Antonio Current this morning, and I haven't heard you any of you talking about it. So I thought, you know what? TSR, bring this up. Maybe get some feedback from the fans about, you know, this is a good thing, a bad thing. I mean, if the Spurs are getting a new arena, obviously it's a good thing. It means they're staying in San Antonio. But is this location a good one? Let me know as the San Antonio Spurs accidentally confirm they're looking to relocate downtown. Drop a comment down below. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe to become part of our awesome sports community. Let's get into it. Ba -ba -da -ba. Spurs Sports and Entertainment confirmed, albeit accidentally, that the Silver and Black are in active talks with city officials and the University of Texas at San Antonio to build a new arena at the former site of the Texas Institute of Culture at Hemisphere. It's a lot of big words. The revelation came after Daly filed a Freedom of Information Act request. And with that, the University of San Antonio announced earlier this month it was vacating the property and relocating the Institute of Texas Cultures. In a rebuttal to the Daily's Freedom of Act request, Spurs Sports and Entertainment argued that it should not be forced to disclose the requested documents because they regard the possible purchase, lease, and or development of real property that has not been publicly disclosed. Hmm. Prematurely disclosing the location of these properties will adversely affect all party planning and negotiating positions Spurs Sports and Entertainment added. The Express News only requested information specific to the property at 801 East Caesar East Chavez Boulevard, suggesting that Spurs Sports Entertainment official admitted in the rebuttal that the NBA franchise is actively in talks regarding the downtown property. The apparent confirmation of the Spurs plans for a downtown arena comes after months of speculation that the Silver and Black are considering a move to Hemisphere after playing for more than two decades at the aging Frost Bank Center on the east side. Okay, so a lot of this is a little confusing. And I'm not a legal expert for fans, but what I'm getting from this article is that it was put out there that if you're interested in this property, you have to disclose this with this Freedom of Information Act. And the Spurs rebutted, hey, you know, this isn't public knowledge, yet, so we don't feel like we should have to disclose anything yet, which kind of confirms in a way that they're interested and probably looking to move downtown. This isn't a surprise that the Spurs are building a new arena with Wemby there. You got to think Wemby, old arena. Time to, you know, time for, time for a new arena, I guess, <laughs> short of it. And this is good news, though, in the end, because if the Spurs are looking to build a new arena in San Antonio, that means they're looking to stay in San Antonio for the next 10, 15, 20 years, whatever it may be, because a lot of fans have been saying, well, they're moving to Austin, they're moving to Austin, or they're leaving Texas, which would be an absolute disaster. I would be, I'm sure, like many of you, absolutely heartbroken if the San Antonio Spurs left Texas and they were the Las Vegas Spurs or whatever it may be. I don't know if I could keep following the team if that happened. I'm, I'm a San Antonio Spurs fan, not a whatever, insert state, city, whatever Spurs fan. So it, it would be tough if they left. This is good news. This is not guaranteed they're going downtown whatsoever, but at least it gives us as a fan base, okay, they're looking for an arena. We kind of may have spoiled a little bit here. You know, I've let the cat out of the bag that this is an area they're looking in. Again, is downtown San Antonio, a, is it a better location? When I was in San Antonio in December 2022, the Frost Bank Center seemed to be a pretty easy location to get to. That being said, the team was pretty bad at the time, so the arena wasn't exactly packed and traffic it wasn't too bad if you smell what I'm cooking. So, in the end, I think this is good news. Just a short video here today. I wanted to share this with you. I saw it and I thought, you know what? This is kind of interesting. This means they're looking for an arena and they're, they're planning, most importantly, and staying in San Antonio. <laughs> That's all I got, Spurs fans. I appreciate you watching the video. Thank you all for support, and uh, hope you're having a great day. Thank you, and as always, go Spurs, go.